I'm one of those people on a mission to save the planet. There's a whole bunch of us trying to save the planet, but I'm one of those people that trying to find sustainable process to help reduce carbon dioxide and yeah, help save the planet or sustain the planet. Photosynthesis is the basic principles of carbon dioxide plus water to give you useful carbohydrates. And one of those useful carbohydrates is algae. And that algae can be used to be turned into useful products like uh, fuel or medicine or food. So since we couldn't find algae at Wits University, we came here to Zoo Lake, which was just like about 10 minutes from Wits and we like just took some algae and we took that back to the lab and my co-worker what he did is filtered it to separate the algae and the water from all these other contaminants like the leaves and then he bubbled CO2 through that water solution and then an algae started to grow from that so he was trying to find the best CO2 bubbling rate or CO2 tolerant algae and then basically I took that algae that he found and tried to improve its production rate in the lab. He sent the algae for DNA sequencing and they found out it was a, a species of algae that's quite high in lipids. So we know that this algae is good for producing a biofuel. Eventually, one day, our carbon sources like the fossil fuels will run out. We have to try now and take this algae and turn it into biodiesel. So we've improved its production rate, but further research we can try and make biodiesel and instead of using a petrol or normal diesel from coal, which is a non-renewable source, we can actually use like biodiesel from algae, which is a sustainable process. Yeah.